Hello. I borrowed this Delta planer from a friend's dad. Um, he had it was just sitting in his garage. He wasn't using it. I didn't know how good. A, I knew I needed to buy a planer. I didn't know how good a planer I needed. I uh, I borrowed this one. It worked well. It got the job done. It's got a couple nicks in the blade. I use it mostly on reclaimed, almost exclusively on reclaimed wood. So I wasn't worried about a couple nicks in the blade. It really made it much nicer surface than it originated with. And uh, you know, I, I learned that for what I was going to do right now that. Without spending a lot of money on a fairly large planer, uh, 13 inch planer is probably all I needed. So, being I like the way this one worked and had its flaws, but a lot of its flaws were fixed with this basically by having an in feed and out feed table and the snipe issues I had with this one, I hopefully don't have with the new Delta, the new version. Uh, I got a good deal on it, it's been sitting in a box for a month. It's time to get the thing opened up and see how it works. Let's get started. Uh, the planer I bought is the Delta model number 22590. It's a 13 inch planer, has three cutter heads. Um, the cutter heads are not sharpenable, but they are double sided. So you get to flip them once. It says it weighs 79 pounds according to the box. Looks like a fairly nice T-handled Allen, or no, a Torx, T30 maybe. The crank handle for the, uh, to raise it and lower it. The lock handle. A pair of bolts, probably to hold the handles on. And an instruction manual in the top section. Get bag, a little more styrofoam and wood. I don't know how much assembly there is. This thing looks pretty assembled to me. I expected to spend a couple hours setting, putting this thing together and setting it up at least an hour. Normally a person should probably open up an instruction manual, but and I will read the instruction manual. I just always like to use something first. It's amazing the tips and tricks that I've learned reading instruction manuals. Though. been an auto mechanic for 22 years. I still read an owner's manual whenever I get a new car or a new to me car. I don't buy new cars. But it's amazing the tricks I've learned too. The little things of 
pull down your unlock button and all your windows roll down after three seconds. I would have never known the car did that if I didn't read the owner's manual. In feet and out feet tables that fold down. That looks real nice. Yes, sir. Oh, dust collection. switch down. is this piece. I don't really mind the sawdust from this. It's not really sawdust, it's wood shavings. I have a shop back that I use. This dust collection. I don't have a real dust collector, so I think I'll let the shavings pile up on the ground for now. time into this I haven't uh, I didn't really plan for this at all I can't believe it's I believe ready to ready to go kind of want to just turn it on and feed a board through it but I hate to find out it has a uh, something holding the blades in place for damage and to keep them protected in shipping and not remove it well, might, might not be a good idea so let me just read this real quickly here. And that tells me how to use it, tells me how to use it. Depth gauge, southward, hardwood, how much to take off. Blah, blah, blah. I think we're ready to turn this thing on. This is an amazingly quick setup. I might not, I wouldn't have spent a month in a box if I knew I could have used it this fast. table saw from a pawn shop. I spent an hour and a half setting that thing up. That was together and working. I still wasn't super happy with my results. Let's find a board to plane.
nice shavings coming off of there. I can't believe what a new blade does with one of these. Shavings nice and long, the finish is nice, a little bit of snipe, oh that snipe is up a little bit there. Much nicer than the other one did. Little bit of, a little bit right there, it's probably because of the knot. Just a little bit right there, you're probably not going to be able to see that, but yeah. Um, I'll do a follow-up video after I've used it and see how it, see how it really works. But man, I just unboxed this thing and was up and running in minutes. It seemed. Let's see how long it's actually been. Eleven minutes. I wasn't trying to hurry. I wasn't. Yeah. I, I like the cut it made in the beginning. I'm real happy so far. I'll do a follow-up video in a month or two when I've. Uh, Used it a handful of times or more, and we'll see how it works. Thanks you for thanks for watching. Until next time. Good night.